Behind lock and key and a heavy lead door, thousands of British pounds all to be melted down. Why? They're worthless and just a fraction of what's on the UK streets. They're 41 million counterfeit coins at large. If it wasn't made here, it's a fake. Pound coins are pressed at the Royal Mint premises in South Wales under tight security and meticulous checks, all meant to outsmart the counterfeiters. But more often than not, the counterfeiters outsmart the rest. Even these guys are having trouble spotting the difference. Paul, I've got two identical coins here. Which one is a fake? This one is the counterfeit. How can you tell? Very quickly, you can see, you can see this image um, and how blurred it is. And also, you can see the milling on the edge is very poor. Well, they're getting quite good, aren't they? So some of the coins now are getting more difficult to detect. In fact, they're so difficult to detect, even the banks are passing them on. The Royal Mint says one in every 36 is a fake, a record number for Britain. The euro coin is much more difficult to copy. It's the 50 euro note the forgers prefer, but the ECB says fewer have been seized this year. And in the US, it's a $100 note so popular with con artists, the Treasury had to come up with a new one in April. Counterfeit Pound remains a homemade enterprise and is difficult to track. The only solution, some say, is to simply reissue the pound altogether. At the moment, we have a situation where the people are being robbed of their own currency and the currency itself is being debased. And that's something that the government and the Royal Mint simply cannot allow to continue. But a new coin would cost not only the Treasury, but many businesses as well. We believe that the cost to our industry of reminting the coin would be something like £50 million. A business like this would actually suffer effectively a tax on their business. The Royal Mint says there are no immediate plans to reissue the coin. In fact, there are so many in circulation already. The only pound coin the Mint is pressing at the moment is the Egyptian pound. Anastasia Hydulina Bloomberg at the Royal Mint.